Gobble the game night, gobble the game night, gobble the game night, yay! Hey guys, Gavi here, and I am playing some Ultraman Magic Action Machine in my And it we are in the clouds and stuff. Do you actually have anything that I need to buy? Buy? Uh, no. Uh, no. Nothing good. Nothing good. Water. Water. I also have water. Water, water everywhere. My water Not a drop to drink. Well, you have water. Whoa. Sorry about that. My water's for drinking. Anyway, we're continuing on with the campaign of champions or whatever. <clears throat> Hopefully gonna beat the game. Huh. You're still not here yet. Well, considering they've only got three members, they probably took a little longer to finish the quiz game and fighting against the queen. I'm sure they're just taking their time getting properly equipped and all that. They can take all the time they need. We're still gonna mop the floor with them. This is their last chance to prove themselves. More ways than one. By the way, as much as it caught me off balance a little, that quiz game thing was pretty fun. Since all of us got to find the answers together. <coughs> yes, indeed. The rush of excitement when faced with a heart pounding trial and reflecting <laughs> upon our previous adventures with which to search for the correct knowledge. Oh, it makes this night's heart sing. Yeah, even with how big a deal this is, it's nice to still have that feeling of. Hey, we're playing a game and having a good time, you know. I don't ever want to lose that. Same. I hope everyone can still feel that way. Even them. I like those three. I believe in them. Don't forget. If we lose again a single time from here on out, it's all over. Yes, I am aware. I haven't forgotten. Yeah, we're a streaming service. <laughs> yeah, we're fifteen dollars a month. We were feeling pretty good when we first got here, because the mushroom man gave us a really nice compliment. But then we got blown up by that Mario guy. I'm close to the phone to King Petopio. Because we know we can kick your ass. Yeah, so. but, but I gotta ask, why do you guys call me that? You know, I just don't know how to pronounce that name. Ker Popper. Ker Roper. Gopher. It's Kerbifer. Uh, can I call you Buffy? Please don't. We worked on some moves I think you'll really like. Uh, at least I hope so. I like your new attitudes, boys. But we've got a date with Destiny at the top of that tournament bracket, and we can't get eliminated here. So get ready to say goodbye. Oh, bye bye. What fucking team was I going down with? Cover for I like a flangle. Sure. If I can play this again. Boss. Quick, so. <clears throat> I'm watching your every move. Hope I won't be disappointed. All right then. So the lines are drawn. Fire up, dog. Generic pre-battle bad to die alone. Wow. I hope my arm will always stay. I'm probably to jam it like 10 minutes ago. I accidentally jammed into something. That really hurts. Are you still able to play or do I need to sub in for you? I believe I'm still able to play. Okay. <laughs> ah. I did not get a single chance to block that. Good. Okay, uh, who does I got for us? Parts of Wakun. Yeah. Forgot how to do that for a second. So is this gonna be a fun fight like we've been having lately, or is this going to be not so much? Uh, so far I'm thinking of not so much. Since I might be a boring fight, I just wanna know. 
Theoretically, I could have brought in someone to flower these guys. But you know, honestly, that doesn't make the fight even less interesting, so. <clears throat> if I lose the fight, I'll do that. <clears throat> if you lose the fight, we're gonna get the bad ending. I mean, yeah. Are you trying to show off the bad ending? I mean, if I lose, I will. So the answer to that question is no, I'm not. But if it happens, it happens. Right. But the question was, were you trying to show the bad ending? And the answer to that is no. Thank you. We went a long way around just to get to that. We should play some GeoGuessr. GeoGuessr is pretty good. We should put up a GeoGuessr video on VDC today. My penny is weak to fire. Oh, Get no. punch you all together, skate boy back again, yes forever, you got Rocky throwing bombs at ya, watch out now, they're gonna catch ya, yeah that sucked, I'm sorry. <laughs> Can I do some healing? This shouldn't be too bad of a fight. And by that you mean it's winnable or it should actually be kind of fun? Uh, yes. Honestly, this is like the only time in the game where I can both uh, actually survive and also not turn everyone into flowers. Cause that's literally like all I've been doing this entire game. The tongue everyone into flowers. No worries, fam. We got you. Please don't heal him up. Ah, so you just can't kill Raccoon first. Wish I knew that before. Okay, so maybe killing him. Killing in the name of. They actually all have the same stats except for Skate has higher stats. Skate things, Skate. I'm awake, then attack with my stats. <sighs> they're so higher, so there ain't no coming back. Once you face me. Yeah, once you face me. Uh, what's this element? Technical. That makes him weak to. Natural, I think. I'll play some Mega Man. Actual. I'll play some Mega Man. Sure. That's all I'm gonna do for now when you're playing games. Talk about other better games we could play. <laughs> As a turn off this game, it's just Mega Man. Alright, let's do it. We worked super hard on this one. No, not Flame Girl. Please don't hit Flame Girl. Flame Girl's dead. <laughs> I think Flame Girl's dead, despite it's my favorite. <laughs> it looks like so flat on the ground. She just got run over by a fucking steamroller. <laughs> I like the aggravated look of her little ghost sprite too, like really. I hadn't noticed that before. I don't know if all the ghosts look like that or not. Boop pop. I think his stats are higher because he's doing flips. You know, maybe I should have taken out Archie first. Bomb arrows. They stole that from Breath of the Wild. Actually, his first in Link's Awakening. Was it? I yes. didn't remember that. We totally played that. He can equip a bomb in your bow, and then if you press the buttons at the same time, it releases a bomb out. Wasn't there something like that in Evil Land also? <clears throat> maybe. I know. You, well, you could shoot through fire and make a fire. Or maybe that's what I'm thinking of. <clears throat> Evil Land's a good game. It is. Evil, Evil Land, Land Two is even, even it's an even better game. E even if you don't like Evil Land One, I recommend Evil Land Two. Very much. Evil Land Fun is totally fun though. Evil Land Fun? Huh? 
Evil Land fun? I said Evil Land 1 is totally fun. You said Evil Land fun is no, totally fun. No, I did fun. not. You very much did. It probably just sounded like that. You very, that was very much an F sound. I got an F sound for you. <laughs> Please don't kill Flame Goal. That would be rude. Maybe a decent in a long fight. Casting it, flame goal. I completely forgot Club before I had to revive and move and told us now. Circle buffer. That's pretty fire. a full heal. Yes. A full, meal, full is a full meal is a full heal. I understand, but... Skate is dead. Not Archie next. Skate. Dead. It's time to kill Archie comments. <clears throat> How much of this fire are you actually going to keep in the video? Maybe 50%. Okay. So no titles can come out of this fight. I don't know uh, how much you'll keep it. Well, I'm not gonna make notes for titles if you're gonna just cut it out. Like if I if I said name the video Pretty Fire and then you cut out that part where I said that's some pretty that's pretty fire, it would make no sense. I don't know, maybe I'll leave in this whole fight now. <clears throat> oh my god, please don't. <laughs> Are you trying to punish your viewers? Oh no, another explosive arrow. It'd be, it'd be awesome if that fire like made the air explode before it could hurt you. Yeah. Some cool little defensive set like that. First things first, I'ma whack you with the baseball bat. I look kinda like Sans, but I got on a hat. Okay, Johnny. <clears throat> that rainbow flame kinda sucks. I don't think it's as good as Sun Shotgun, technically.
That campfire isn't actually still active. It's just glitching? Yes. What's glitch your Tome or Lego games? And I can't even put up a new campfire. That's how hard it's glitching. Honestly, at least in Tome I haven't soft locked myself out of being able to complete the game yet. Yeah. And at least my saves work. And at least not Lego Skywalker Saga. I'm trying to like Lego Skywalker Saga. It's just it not that good as a Lego game. <clears throat> well, you want to abandon it? It's like I want to see it through. I mean, we got Cuphead coming out in June. Apologies for Crinkles, brother. I'm just going to open some oatmeal cookies. By the way, I'm pretty sure Box is done playing now. Oh, wait, no. He's back to playing. He just sang up like two tones doing nothing. And it's like half the characters are the same. Being player two kind of sucks sometimes. As in the entire Anakin and Obon fight. Hell, at some point we were both droids in that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then for some reason it swapped to a Zobuon. <laughs> So then you just got to be... Apparently, R2-D2 and C-3PO are supposed to be on little platforms to the side, but for some reason you're on the platform fighting Anakin with me. You are not supposed to be there, you're just supposed to be spectating from the side or something. 300, yay. Honestly, kind of easy. Eliminated. We really enjoyed kicking your ass. But rather a mere merry band of bastards. Our plucky adversarial comic relievers. Um, this young squire is honored, sir Nylock of the kindest race. And it's just he just called you dudes comic relief. Oh no, you really turned things around. I'm so proud of you. Now you just gotta make sure you keep this up. She said everything, so let's go down a list of everything in the world. Anything you can possibly think of, interact with, believe, whatever. I want to hear it all. And that's just the rest of this video. The team attacks they've crafted are such a new feature. That by having those, it's a pretty clear indication they've left their old ways behind. It would have been impossible for them to pull off any of their usual tricks this time. Huh. Well, that's a good sign then. Yeah. That's some strange logic. Alright, uh, good job everyone. We're one step closer. 
Yeah, and I only four more boss fights to go through. I thought that was a chicken at first. No, it's a hen ten. Hot tub time machine. See us four seconds later. Honestly, forever I don't care. <clears throat> Racing minigame. No more fights. Racing minigame. <laughs> Not to mention very fitting of my own tribe. There were many warriors across the terrain who sought to make it up here. Hundreds, maybe even thousands failed. Sure, anyone can have a dream, but it's following through with it that makes a dream come true. It's an underestimated part of the journey and the way to being a winner. Yes, sir. That's what this is all about. Perseverance. Your drive to be a winner, so to speak. So, equally fitting, I figure what better way to exemplify your drive than by running you over with a car. <laughs> hey, I remember that guy. The one with the cool motorcycle. He gets. The mysterious cloaked figure is in league with Net King Exec. Nonetheless, it would seem thou were correct in thy assumption, Sir Kalafa. You might be familiar with my associate, Ute. He'll be assisting me in the trial here. That's right, a racing battle Execute. with truly. Wait, how are we gonna do this? Oh, and don't worry, I took the liberty of procuring you a vehicle for the competition. It's a car, yay! My baby! It's the Pixel Cruiser! What are you waiting for? Hop in. Let's get so if I lose this, do I, do I get game over? No, you only get game over if you lose against the guild, right? I, I think. Should we all just get in the car? Screw it. Yes. Violent people. Top job. I'm pretty sure if we lose against anything, it's game over. We've only oh. got one shot. So if I lose this, it's literally only like the last two commands matter. I can manage to do nothing for ninety percent of the mini game. The last two things. Don't make any assumptions. I maybe maybe they succeed. buffed it up. I think I had to start because I couldn't tap Y quick enough. What the fuck? I pressed the thing. This is going well. <laughs> what the fuck? How do we all fan this car? Mash! Bash! Stash! Dash! Flash! You see, I can't be any further ahead than this. So. He's got a dope car, though, you gotta admit. It. I prefer what the, the fuck? My L stick movements aren't working. I prefer the racing chrono trigger. Yeah. Okay, this sucks. The thing is, it's working to turn. There we go. There you go. Okay, you gotta use the picture of all of them in the car together as the thumbnail. Okay. <laughs> I have to succeed this. Maybe them ducking, because that looks really funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe like that. Finish. All right, no fight, please. That was the end. We get to continue on. No, I'm going to kick your ass. <laughs> well done. <laughs> you know, I've been keeping my eye on all the visiting warriors within tone for a very long time. Glad to see my confidence wasn't for nothing. When Bincho sought to overthrow me from my position, while I could have easily escaped his capture, I thought it'd be an interesting opportunity to test the city's resolve. So, using you as my eyes and ears, I continued to keep watch, hoping that some clever heroes would rise to the challenge. I was astounded at how well everybody adapted to such a desperate situation, and even more so at how many had banded together to come to my rescue. Everything's worked out really well. At least, so far. But, as I'm sure you know, the journey's not quite over. As you move onward and upward, you'll have to face an even more desperate situation than ever. But, uh, if I'm right, 
and I have been before, I think you'll do just fine. Okay. I wish you good luck, but uh, <laughs> you don't need it. See ya! Thank God, no fight. I don't need more like 30 minute fights that are boring and boring. <clears throat> Is the fourth trial gonna be a rhythm game? That's what I'm hoping. I think there's a story there. Indeedly so. Our fated rematch with the Casco Dreams looms over. I don't think he's so cool in real life. Mm. <clears throat> we heard her reaction like she was hiding something. Could be anything. I think he tried to hit on her. Mm. He's probably a dick. Quite some him low somewhere. He's got he's got to do seven different side quests. They only unlock on one day. And it's time for the cast of dreams. I'm sure they'll be here any second now. I wasn't surprised they won that racing battle too. Now how did all they fit in the call? It would have been kinda neat if they were acted out in real time by the staffers themselves. Yeah, for a second when Batopio first showed up, I almost thought it was the real guy. But that probably would have been a little too complicated, but with needing them to be in four places at once. If anything, it's nice they recorded a bunch of new stuff just for this. Plus, they might not be as improv savvy as Nyloth and his friends, huh? No, oh, thou flatters this night, Lady Games Off. The glorious Net Games have their own brand of showmanship that even I. Oh, the dragon of conveying righteously respectful kudos! Cannot help but be in utter awe of. I don't mean to piss all over the magical moment here, but we can't let the cast of dreams pull that last step again, or it's over. Yeah, fair enough. Are you doing all right? You've been really quiet since the first fight with these guys. I'm fine. I'm just focusing. Everyone else should do the same. We are. I don't blame you for being worried, but I've got a plan. Don't start having any doubt. I, I'm not. I'm not the plan is to suck upon them for fight. <clears throat> I found out where one of them lives in real life. I'm going to hunt them down and hold them hostage. I am hacking into the computer right now. Sorry we couldn't make this the final match of the bracket. Would have been cool to go out on a high note. Yeah, to be honest, that Zeto guy wasn't very nice. Wasn't a very interesting match either. Not to mention, what a drama queen! Actually, the last two of our battles have ended far too quickly, if you ask me. Nobody uh, uh, Well, one of you did say we're here to win, right? I say we give our friends here an encore and leave them in the dust. I see what you did there. And I agree. And we pretty please. They're actually right. <laughs> you repeat what you did before, you'll probably win. But that's not really your style, is it? Especially after the loss against Seto. Probably want to give the audience a better show, right? What? Who cares about the audience? You do! You said earlier you didn't want to waste their time, remember? I was being sarcastic! Do nip luck. I know you're not all that keen on us because we're competition, but a bunch of these guys are old friends. Maybe take that into consideration? This knight acknowledges the cast as talented performers of their own flavor and greatly desires to be treated to an unforgettable show on such a glorious stage such as this. Same here. I think there was an extra suction there. I don't know if I just want to see it. So what'll it be, huh? You guys gonna throw down for real or what? Oh my god. They're clearly trying to bait you. We've got a winning strategy here. Let's trounce them and make a comeback against Seto in the final. Yeah, honestly, Dust Bunny's right. I mean, yeah, but... And the what do you want to do? Uh, the choice is yours now. <clears throat> Whatever you may decide, we believe in you. I to that. They're dusting all the way, lass. Stop their faces in! In whatever way you want to do it. <laughs> Don't 
Don't delay, ladies. Please, do what you want to do with these fools. We got your back with whatever's attack you want to whack this pack with. So go, go, go for it, yo. Nice. Thanks, everybody. I've decided. I'm going to be a sucker. Cast four founding members. Bring it in, people. Oh, baby! I've been waiting all day for this! Splendid. This will be a rematch for the ages, old chums. We've got our team. How about you guys? Uh, should I bring in GameSoft and say a flame girl, you think? Because the troublemakers, I know I could turn them into flowers. <clears throat> Maybe Tiger Lily. Yeah, probably Tiger Lily. They're going to bring in their old cast to fight against their old friend who's not coming into the battle. <laughs> Alright, we suck a jaw. <laughs> Once again, turn them into flowers. For this day. Let us make it a battle to remember. I believe you got your answer. Is Tiger yeah. Lily even equipped? I have no idea. Not this time. Sorry. <coughs> all happens, it happens, it happens. This is the way I want to do it. We've reached the climax, folks. But let's not let this be the final act. Ready? Can Tiger Lily go first, please? Cause I know the first time I fought them, they had a freaking bullshit attack. Hey, uh, whichever way this turns out, the end, I hope we'll still all be I don't think you knew if y'all were friends. <laughs> Your friend stayed on the sidelines. I can turn Snow Whitey into a flower. <laughs> Everyone else is immune. That uh, was the elements: technical, neutral, and neutral. I mean, Nalak has ice though, doesn't he? Uh, yes. Only some of them are immune to ice. Yes, that is a true fact. So you could freeze some. Mm. Which ones are not immune? Snow White is the only one immune to it. Yeah. So if I actually... Ah, she was just... Uh, that may not have been small. Wow, is Tiger Lily the slowest out of all these? You know, the amount of customization suggested in this game by all the various characters we see mm -hmm. <laughs> really makes me salty at the fact that we just got Hattie. Yeah, by the way, uh, Snow White is stuck like that for the rest of the time now. Because the flower. Wow, it'd be really nice if we could flower some other folk. Hopefully, well. So, Snow White is the least of our concerns. <clears throat> and she's uh, also I mean, facing backwards. Really, all these varied characters <clears throat> with their various abilities, and we get stuck with Sans with a baseball bat. Yep. I totally know I was doing that. Is a game with this much customization even freaking possible? I don't know. I mean, I don't play MMORPGs, so. But that, yeah, I agree with you. It does feel a little. Yeah. Sus. Like. Are you really gonna be able to change that much? I've said that before, though. Yeah, I remember in the original Tome web series, the thing was like you may you, you could like scan your character into the game off of art, and then the game would pull him in there. And then not only that, it would supposedly choose your move set for you based off your character. <coughs> I think they overestimated the point for us. Uh, that guy has star shield on, so this fight this person instead, I guess. Boop 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 boop. Can I still like my stab done if then that? I can't, it, it does not do much. 
Oh no, one damage to all of us. What will we ever do? Oh, then fight this guy harder. It's much easier than the first fight we had against them. Stop putting on your freaking star suit. <coughs> and that move is a mean. <clears throat> Sorry. Technically, though, but you know, Tom, I have no idea how the character customization worked. Because the original Tom was called, like, Tom TV or something on Newgrounds. It, it it was definitely something. I've only watched like the first season, which is what the web series is based off of. <clears throat> uh, and that series, Kirby Foot, is literally a Kirby. I'm dead, I guess. How unfortunate. Yeah, I think I have all the Burning Tomb. I think I still like the web series the best, probably. This one's pretty good too, though. This one probably has the best writing out of any of them. Like the part of the web series and the first season of the original New Brand series, we're pretty much about like this virus thing that Alpha found that made him like super strong and stuff, but also made him go like berserk. The web series expand on the virus, I think, more. On the web series that are on Cobra Four, the same and stuff, and then Game Soft is also the games the AI and some stuff. I 
It's been a decent day since the last one. Hey, Saturn it. Diva, how you feeling about your choice right about now? <laughs> I've got a plan. I have a strategy. They're weak-willed and easily manipulated. <clears throat> I'll convince them not to bring in their best players. Honestly, yeah, I'm pretty sure that was the entire plan. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I've got a plan. Manipulation. <clears throat> Wait, how many hit points does Sniper Rider have? Oh, okay. Two thigh. I read that number something way higher at first. So they drive away off the screen and then something hurts us on the other side. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, well, they snipe us. Oh. Uh, okay. Couldn't they have just done that from where they are? I mean, yeah, but... Alright, now they own enough to snow why he's Seriously, so though, at this point, it's almost like when people create their character, they just completely design all of their moves on their own. Yeah. And the team moves. Yeah, because I mean, we've literally seen... I mean... We only got to choose between them, but it was like the characters were picking out moves. Yeah. <clears throat> Which mine you can make custom moves in games to some degree. Yeah. But I'm not sure if you can do it to this degree. Without just insane. Oh no, clearly you can't, because we got stuck with hat and bat. <laughs> We're just, we're just a fucking Dr. Seuss book. <laughs> the hat with the bat. This definitely feels like it's at least partially based off Sword Art Online. Since, at least in the original web series, Tom <clears throat> was a VR game in the year 2020. Which, uh, Sword Art Online is a VR game in the year 2022. So. This is the year 2022. It is. Good job. <clears throat> Sadly, Sword Art Online has not come out yet. I think we should probably wrap it up after the cutscene. Alright. And that's on the final fight with Zeto, I think. Well, unless you oh, want to. Oh, no, there's still one more thing. Yeah, okay. What's that? There should be enough for another episode. <clears throat> oh, it depends on how long the Zeto fight is, honestly, because I'm pretty sure it's going to be a rhythm battle against. Well, you do whatever you feel What's like. If you want, just want to record it all, and we can cut it up later if you want. Yeah. That's always possible. Astrologist was originally Mosca, voiced by Masako X. That's all you have to say for yourself? If you had just stuck to the plan, we could have beaten them. Strange. I can't speak for everybody else, but I don't feel too bad about it. What are you talking about? Wasn't this whole thing about reaching the end? Do you not feel even just the slightest bit of remorse that everything we worked for up to this point was for nothing? No. Why would I feel remorse for having one of the best months of my life being surrounded by mostly a bunch of people I would choose to spend my free time with anyway on a game that I love? Sure, it would have been nice to make it to the very top, but this is where the journey ends. I got nothing to and that was what we were striving for. If we won the prize money, we were all gonna fly out somewhere to celebrate with each other in person. Well, once the quarantine was over, anyway. Hey, 2,000 bucks split between 10 people ain't so bad. Maybe we can still make it happen after all. I'll limit bitch in. It's like, what, 200 bucks per person? Yeah. Oh, can we? I'd love that. Then everything really would be worth it. Well, if it happens, consider yourselves invited. This was a great match, so you're all welcome to join. Oh, come in! Right back at ya! This night was totally worth it. Wait a second, why did Wayne freaking Dust Bunny even care about this? I guess they wanted us to make sure we don't take out Zeto. Because they're getting paid off by Zeto. And this clash was undoubtedly a dream battle to remember! Steph, whatever it is you want that prize money for, just make sure that spiky headed freak doesn't nab it instead. As far as I'm concerned, this is all down to you guys now, so get up there and sock him in the face once for me. Deal. And see you around? You bet.
There's no save point here, so I think I'm gonna do the first trial real quick. Before wrapping up this episode. Maybe I'll go all the way. If I have time, I might also show off the bad ending. so far, and you're so very close to your final destination. I think I speak for all four of us when I say that we, the Mighty Net Kings, are impressed beyond all imagination by each of your valiant efforts. But before you can reach the highest point of our sacred realm, you have one last trial to fulfill. And speaking of fulfillment, that is in fact what the trial of yours truly is all about. Attainment. Finishing what you started. With the initiative to get you going, the dedication to stick with it, and the perseverance to follow through with it. You arrive at your ultimate goal and must now prove yourselves worthy of achieving it. With all the knowledge, strength, and courage you've kept in your hearts the entire way. And perhaps it's no surprise to you, but I firmly believe the best way to prove to us, to yourselves, to all of the people rooting for you, that you are ready to take the final stage and seize victory is by way of a musical number! <laughs> oh lord, it's one of these! A rhythm battle. I thought so. We've got this, don't worry. Okay, Nye, Hattie, and Sakti. Why is everyone so annoyed that oh, oh. easy? Gotcha, I'm ready. We managed it's, to beat her These are easier than most of the battles. Do it again right here. We're right away, Guildmaster. This knight is ready to shake my... Yeah, there were rhythm games in game. Evil Land 2. Remember? They're much harder than that. No, because you can just tap all the buttons at one time in that. Remember? <laughs> Break a leg out there, people. I'll be cheering you on with backing vocals. Come on, step away. Come on. I'm so excited to see your resolve come to life in the form of song and dance. Let the last Net King trial commence. It's showtime! It's fine that we're doing the dance thing here. Of the rhythm game here when we first saw it and I believe the uh, event for the crystal section oh the the singing but you can't hear him because it's always quiet I suck at this game. But it's so easy! <laughs> Look, that's me being done. Watch, miss one thing and suddenly you lose the entire thing. I...
Roblox so happy right now. Quick turn down before they talk. I want to go fight the Blood Master as well. Regardless, you have proven yourselves. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. The Grand Overseer of Tome. Your attainment is triumphant. Is just within reach. Go quickly now. Please save point. Because why now? If I lose, I have to go all the way back to before that other battle. Please have a save point. Please. Someone tells me I'm not getting a save point. Maybe. Maybe this is teleport, teleport save point, please. Ah, oh, dang it. There's a cutscene though. <laughs> Can't look at my equipment. I, I know Alpha was kind of talking about this already, but I gotta say, despite how serious our whole situation is, this has still been fun. Like, really fun. My little intro just now was pretty accurate, I'd say. No, uh -huh. thank you, Sir Kamalfa. Every day this night is surrounded by each of thee. It feels like a new, exciting chapter in the never ending quest of life. Truly. If we win this thing, maybe we ought to make like a cast of dreams and throw our own party. We have plenty left to spare. I bet we could. Or, as long as that's okay with you, Steph. Are you kidding? I'm all for celebrating when this is over. Are you kidding? What? We haven't even gotten past Webmaster. Which, by the way, will probably be close to, if not just as hard as the fight with Zeno. Let alone facing him, which may still be next to impossible. And you're joking around like you've already won? Oh, whoa. I think Tycho is, is a little stressed out. This isn't just focusy. I've been acting weird almost the entire time. This can't just be because we lost in that first round, is it? I'm pissed off because we're playing exactly into his hand. Every step of this event has been set up just the way he was planning, and it's not even remotely a sure thing we can change it in the end. This is all going to come down to whether or not we can tilt him from his stupid, untouchable attitude, and he's already going in with all the advantages he could ever ask for, and it sucks! Lady Tiger Lily, calm myself. The 
pressures of the conclave of courage are invading thy mind, body, and spirit. Do not let such hazy visions of dark futures blind thee. Think of how far the Alliance has come in our time within the sacred realm. I just want you guys to take this seriously. You all get that, don't you? How important this is? I'm so sorry. We're not making you regret all this, are we? No, it's not like that. This... this isn't any of your faults. Then, with all due respect, would you rather us be constantly stressed and freaking out about this the whole way? Of course we remember how big a deal this is. I know that, I just... Ugh, this is the worst! He's probably laughing his bloated head off as we speak! Hey! Pull it together! What? Letting him win before we even step to the ring, because you're acting obsessed. And for what even? If he's such a piece of crap, why spend all this energy on him? Because I want him to pay for what he's done. All this effort he spent cheating his way to the top, the people he's manipulated, all while believing that, as a result, he's still legitimately the best. It's... it's not right. I understand where you're coming from, but thinking that we're... Playing right into his hand isn't the right perspective to take. Think about it. Isn't this kind of what you were expecting already? For him to be waiting at the very top for us to push him off? I... I don't think I know anymore. I didn't expect to feel like this right before the end. I can't describe it. You were the one who told me before. We stick to our guns and keep our cool so we can make him lose his perfect focus. If any of us falter, it's over. This is gonna sound silly. They may all just be a bunch of pre-recorded cutscenes we're experiencing, but there's a lot of truth to what the Netkin said on the way up here. Perhaps at first glance, it is the interactions with our other former enemies leading up to the final showdown that make of thee uneasy. However, the four excellent qualities that the Netkins have each commended us for are in fact what brought us to this place to begin with. That's the corniest thing ever. And also true. But you made a good point earlier, too. If that pleb takes himself so seriously to the point of being such a miserable person, as far as I'm concerned, we're already teaching him a little lesson in humility by just having a good time. We've made it this far after everything. No matter what the hell he tries to pull. No matter how many advantages he may or may not have. No matter how many odds are stacked against us. We're coming out on top in the end. What she yeah, said, she said. <laughs> you shouldn't have to tell me this. I'm sorry I made you have to. That's why you're our leader. You know it. <sighs> sorry, things got a little heated there. Oh, right. There you go. Too far. You're fine, dude. You just returned the favor and helped me get out of a funk this time when I really needed it. Stupendous! Once again, the Dandy Alliance Plus proves itself unbreakable! Now that we've rediscovered the power of love. What is our plan against both Tome's hardest boss and Tome's biggest egomaniac? When it comes to Webmaster, we'll basically be going in blind. I imagine it'll probably just be a really, really hard standard battle. No mini games or anything. No, it'll be a game of Smash Bros. Yeah, that's probably a fair assessment. So how about I've been giving that a lot of thought over the past few days. And actually, that last conversation made me a hundred percent sure of it now. I've dealt with a lot of bullies in my life, and to no surprise. A handful of them even made their way into a place like Tome. I've always known how to make them comment for comment, and usually it shuts them up pretty quick. But this is a different case altogether. If we're gonna end the be-all once and for all, we're gonna need to take a different approach. So I've decided, regardless of which of the four of us fight him, when the battle starts, nobody say a word. What? Complete silence? He does like to hear himself talk. He'll probably fill up the whole fight with self-indulgent chatter anyway. I get it. It's not like trying to one-up him in his own game. You're not playing his game to begin with, right? That's not a bad idea at all. To be honest, what you just described has been my entire experience with Zeto. Even... Even back when we were friends. But it's exactly why we're not anymore. Well, it's still pretty risky, but it sounds to me like the best route to take. So let's do it. I think this might really pay off. Awesome. This really could work. This could throw Zeno off balance and maybe his whole facade will come crashing down. In fact, 
now that I think about it, he really does tend to get pissed off when we don't buy into his trolling. Exactly. That's actually kind of what I was experimenting around with the last couple times we ran into him. And why I was asking you so many questions about the specifics, Tiger. Yeah. Yeah. If we keep our mouths shut and keep smacking him with one attack after another, every little bit of that might help him lose focus. We all know what that means. Don't make me fantasize. Then our battle routine is set. We shall fight with full force against the godly webmaster. And meet the end all be all with stern conviction and pure determination to outclass his willpower tenfold. Or I'm not. Oh, I see a hint board up there. Hi, hint board. We're already doing so well. Should we make our last couple preparations? Yeah. I please have ready, my save point. To the teleporter and cap this conclave off. You're the boss. She's the boss. Save point. Finally. I think I'll wrap it up here. Okay, so thanks for this episode, guys. Again, yeah, like and subscribe. Good to have a see. And most importantly, Lego Skywalker Saga sucks. Good night. Gobble the game night. Gobble the game night. Gobble the game night. Yay. Come on and watch him play games every other day. If you subscribe now, you won't miss out on any of the action. So come on, click that subscribe button.